Hello beauties, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is gonna be a sassy swap video, so I'm swapping out my purse again. Yes, once again, we are swapping out the bag. So a little bit of backstory on the bag. Uh, it is my mom's, and it is actually a bag that I wasn't expecting to like to carry so much. I thought, oh, I'll just use it to like make a video and see, try it out, we'll see. Uh, but I just really have been adoring it, and I think a lot of it has to do with the changes that my mom made to the bag. The strap, the way it sits, or the way it sat before. Um, it was just very high up. The purse was like in your armpit almost. It just was very uncomfortable to carry and I don't think it looked very flattering. I also didn't think that it looked very flattering when you would carry it on the crook of your arm. Just because of the shape of the bag, it was just a little bit strange. So I'm going to show you on the body just so you guys can actually see the bag and what it looks like and what it looks like on first. I'm going to put those next and then we shall pack the bag together. So enjoy these next few clips of the bag. Uh, kind of make your little, I don't know, make your notes on it and then uh, I definitely love to hear what you think of the bag, what you think of the adjustments that we made to it. I would love to hear all that. So. Here's some shots of me here. I am 5'3 and I don't know how much I weigh, but I'm like extra large down here and then large up here. Anyway, I think it looks cuter like this. I hope you guys do too. And yeah, let's get back to the video. So as you can see, you know, looking at those shots of me wearing the bag, you can see that it's very like slouchy, very slouchy bag. I just don't think it's meant to be carried the way that it was carried before. It was very strange. So, anywho, <laughs> I do want to show you guys the strap close up because it is really beautiful. So this is the kind of gold detail that it has on top and it is very weighted, which I do like because I feel like it keeps the bag on your arm nice and secure. Um, so I believe this is where they made the adjustment. So we got about two, maybe a little over two inches more in space. Anywho, I just thought that was pretty cool to note. And I love this bag now because before I had it and we hadn't done anything to it, I wasn't a huge fan of it. Um, taking it out a few times and actually wearing it out, I do, I love it. I really like it, I like the size of it. I like that the opening is nice and wide. You can just throw your stuff in. You can kind of, you know, reach in this way and grab for what you need. It just works really nicely for like an on the go type of person, which I feel like I am sometimes. This is what the inside looks like. We do have a zipper, pretty big zipper pocket. It doesn't go all the way, uh, like the full length of the bag, but I, it's definitely a really nice, generous size pocket. So I do like that. I like that it's a zipper. So maybe if it's something that's more, um, special that you kind of need to keep in a zipped up spot then you have that little zip pocket and then it also has this little slit pocket right there and the slit pocket stops right there so it's just a tiny slit pocket maybe for lipsticks I'm gonna put my chapstick there so that works so that works out pretty perfect for chapsticks and lipsticks and yes uh, if you're curious or if you haven't figured it out already this is like material it isn't the canvas leather um, it's material so that's my only thing with it I just don't want to touch it with anything gross or stain it um, it's a beautiful bag and I the only flaw that we've got going on so far is this one here. It's just ripping just a teensy bit right over there. But yeah, other than that, this bag is in such beautiful condition, but I honestly 
would never expect anything less from my mom because she does really take care of her bags, which is awesome because I definitely want to have that bag collection. <laughs> okay, we are on to the packing portion of the video. And um, it's, I mean, the usual stuff. So yeah, there's nothing too new in here, but we shall see. So I have my Atelier Pacific Lime perfume that I like to keep, my touch-up pouch. I have my wallet that I really love. I love this wallet so much. My reusable straw. More alcohol wipes. The lipstick I was actually looking for earlier, Honeycomb, I wore it yesterday too, I totally forgot. So Honeycomb by Bite Beauty, it's one of my favorites. You can tell it's almost gone. So that's one of my favorites. And then another favorite is the Glow Recipe Lip Pop. You can tell it's almost, well, it's gone. It's, it's gone. <laughs> still using it uh, and then I have my little my little mirror that way if I need to check I can do that and I'm putting these in that little slip pocket that I showed you guys before and then I have one more thing which is this pouch here this is a pouch that I thrifted in California with my mom well actually my mom thrifted it and then I just Let's just get it out there. I take a lot of things from my mother. <laughs> I'm about to be 30 years old and I still do that. I'm pretty sure it's still a thing though, so it's fine. It's just like a mother-daughter thing. So I have all my, my miscellaneous stuff in here. Uh, stuff that's like tiny and I don't want it to get too lost in the bag. Uh, my hairbrush. We've got more lipstick in there. This is Vive Treasure. I love this, especially for like applying just right in the middle. Loves that. And then another fave is Ophelia from KVD Beauty. Another nude shade, <laughs> similar to Meringue, the one you saw before. Uh, and then Cloud Pout from Wet n Wild. This is actually a nice formula. I don't like the color though. And then I have another favorite, which is Very Victoria from Charlotte. Again, same color. <laughs> Cactus Pear Hand Cream. Again, from my mother, but this was gifted. She actually gave that to me. Um, and then my lip liners and sharpener. And my little pill case. That's kind of strange, but cute. So that's my little cutie bag with all my little goods. I don't want to get lost at the bottom of this bag, so I'll toss that in with that. And I want to put these on the shades that I choose to wear today, and I'm pretty sure it's going to be these. These are my faves. I'm not a huge fan of um, like all black glasses. I do like it for specific outfits, but for every day, for some reason, me, I, it just works with like like warm tones, and then I like a light um, a light lens. So it's a bunch of beads. I like that it's red, and yeah, I am going to wear these today if if we go somewhere which I don't think we will just because it's so dang hot out right now and yeah I hope you guys enjoyed this video and packing my bag with me oh let me know what you think about the bag let me know if you think it's cute if you like it if you would wear it and like comment subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and I will see you in my next video.